there are some Man United fans who want their team to lose just so it takes the wheels off Liverpool's chances. Uh, last week we had a guy on called Mick who's getting abuse from his friends for supporting his club. Mick, you've uh, started a, a petition now on change.org. That's right, lads, yeah. Will I read it out? If you want to, yeah. In recent times, Manchester United supporters have been subject to outrageous verbal and written abuse through personal interactions and social media channels. This has come following some embarrassing defeats of their team, both in the Champions League and the Premier League. This petition is calling on all those guilty of deriding and mocking Man United fans to desist from such actions for the rest of the season and start afresh in August when the club hopefully gets its act together. Some very big words there for United fans. Should you do starters. that by yourself? Of course it is, yeah. Well, last week I was on the show and... Um, I know, it just, kicked off. I did kick off and as a result I've had to make private my social media accounts because of the abuse I've received. What are people Since, saying? All over the weekend. I can't repeat some of the stuff. I mean, you know, in this day and age when, when we need to look after each other and, and things are tough enough out there, I think the vile, disgusting language that's used represents the murky underbelly of the beautiful game. And... I just want to call a stop to it. Do you know what I mean? Just because mm. our team is going through a bad time at the moment, it gives no right, just because Liverpool are going through a purple patch at the moment, it doesn't, give, it doesn't give them the right to actually, you know, abuse us. But Everton, Mick, Everton, 4-0. 4-0. How did you feel about that one? Well, it, well, obviously it wasn't good enough. I'm not here to defend the, the team's performance. Okay, okay, right. I, I want to defend the Manchester United fans who support their team through thick and thin, who never, and I repeat, never gave dogs abuse to Liverpool supporters, not in my case, anyway. So this and is more I've about good, I've good, I've apparently good friends with Liverpool supporters, and over the years, I kept my mouth shut. So this is more about the fans that you're doing this for, not so much the club. Yeah. So who? Yeah, look, I, I've been heartened by the support I've got, as well. There's been as much support as there has been hatred, and I, I use that word. I don't use it lightly. Hatred. Which team supporters give you the most abuse? Liverpool. Liverpool fans. So they're disgusting. So last week wow. we had WhatsApp messages that you shared with us that you were receiving. Yeah, and we have some more that uh, these are again these are ones that are disgusting you, Mick. Yeah, Barry Jenkins. I'm going to call him out again, and he had his cousin there with him, Anto, and they, they are vile people, in is, my opinion. It was Easter human. Sunday of all days that they were sending this. So Barry Jenkins has been in touch with us. He'd like his right to reply, but we'll do that another day, I think. But this is from Barry Jenkins and Anto on Sunday, as Everton were putting four away past United, yeah? Yeah. All right, Mick. Anto's here too. How are you, Mick? Yeah. The radio star, there he is now, huh? A celebrity in his own right, giving out on the radio, you f***ing fool. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, everything today, top four, no problem. Three points in the bag, here we go. Best of luck, Mick. Again, you know, it's the language. Yeah. The language yeah. alone, and yeah. it's just, it's, it's taunting, and it's disrespectful to me. Are they not just having a laugh, Mick? No, it's it's, war, it's it, it gets worse. Okay. Can please play the other clips, because... The referees, Rashford's ball in, he's hit Alisson, Coleman making... They're all over them. They are all over them, absolutely brutal. It's a decent long throw, good trajectory is... Oh! <laughs> You're sick! You're sick! Oh, Everton! Oh, where's your keeper? Brutal! What a player! Poor old Did you respond to these, Mick? No, I didn't. No, I didn't, because I've, I've more respect. There we go. But he's taking it on again. Oh, what about that? <laughs> <laughs> He was nearly on his own halfway line, James! It's country booting goal! Country boots! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. United are officially shy. <laughs> no, I've, I've, known, I've known both those lads since we were 13. Who's 13 and 14. Okay. And I remember when Eric Cantona stuck the ball in the back of the net in the FA Cup final. And I did celebrate. I, I will admit, I did celebrate. But mm. I did not give verbal abuse like that. There was no WhatsApp then, was there? No. You just shouted at your telly. I know about you, Anto. I am thoroughly enjoying this. Oh! 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 oh three! Nil! <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm actually, I'm beginning to feel sorry for these these stupid show millionaires millionaires running around the pitch oh, look, at and that look at that 
Oh, they're brutal. They should be ashamed themselves. Now at that stage it's 3 0, you think they just give up on it. No, you know what I mean? Just leave back? it off. Why don't you message them back and give. Why are you just taking it? I didn't want to. Uh, do, do, look, it'll only make the situation more provocative. All right. Wow. Maybe more. Gary Neville said the 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 Man United team were swanning around. They were just walking around. Everton worked much harder. Again, I'm not here to defend the team and All their right. performance. All I'm right. here yeah. to defend man, right. poor Man United fans. <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh, he's through. He's through. Oh, Jesus! Four, four. Anto, here. What do you think of that? Nico, this is a bit embarrassing, mate. What's left in it? What's left? Blow it up now. I'll show you my dog for now. 8 now. 8 now. Death becomes them. Christ. Everton, like, wow. you can kind of see where they're coming from. That's gone too far. You know, death becomes them. That is a disgusting language. Yeah, but like, you know, some people call it the, the word I don't like. Oh, I don't like the fact that you're making excuses for these lads. No, I'm just, no some just... people call that banter. I don't like that word, but that's what they Well, you, you can use that for anything then, but oh, it's yeah. verbal diarrhea and it's verbal abuse aimed at me, and I'm sick of it. Go on, one, give us one more. One more. If you want to sign... Oh, this, yeah, the, the last one took the biscuit. I oh, switched off my phone after this. You can go to change.org and see the online invitation. Stop, Please stop sign. Stop the just... abuse of Man United Please fans. sign. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we are gathered here today <laughs> to mark the repose of the soul of Manchester United. Hey, that is... Fuck off. Peace. Ah, come on. Nick, we're so sorry. <laughs> That's funny. Your support's such a woeful team. <laughs> but at least you're a social media superstar now and uh, you have a new career going for you. We'll see you at the wake now against City during the week. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> you Muppet. Oh, <laughs> Good luck! Oh, man. It is for that reason, that reason alone, I hope Manchester City hammered us at Old Trafford tonight. Oh, and man. I don't say that likely, I hope we get slaughtered and I hope they win the league. Come on, City! Oh.